What is going on guys, it's Waffa here and welcome back to some more Ark Valkyro. Now last time we left off, we tamed this guy right here, you guys remember two episodes ago, we defeated the Spirit Guardian, and then uh, like a Tamble version of it spawned out, the Spirit Wyvern, it was like level 900 or something like that, we finally tamed this bad boy in last episode, got that like uh, Spirit Orb or whatever we needed to tame it, I got a really lucky hit on it whenever I was, uh, you know, letting it chase me and then of course turning around and then shooting it, got a real lucky hit, first hit, boom, wait for it to get knocked down and then boom, we tamed it, it was crazy and this thing, is amazing you guys it does so much i can damage you guys already saw it last episode but i want to see exactly how much damage you can do against a tier 4 boss a couple of you guys were even saying that as well saying yeah why don't you actually test it out against something i can <laughs> actually put up a little bit of a fight so it's going to be kind of tough though because all the stuff we've taken on last episode just to kind of level this guy up and you do a little bit of a rampage with him they were all like ground type critters that didn't really fly around but at the same time, like the spirit bomb attack seems like it's going to be really good against even flyers. So let's go over here. I did between this episode and last episode, I did get uh, a bunch of resources. So we should be able to make both of these over here. So do I have enough resources to make both of these? I think I do. OK, let's see. Can I make just one of these? Hold on. Just one spirit guardian summoner. OK, yeah, we do. have. OK. Just wanted to make sure I, I wanted to prepare for this episode and I'd be kind of upset if I didn't prepare and I was missing like one random resource or something stupid. But there you go. I guess we can start out with the Chaos Guardian because it, I, I feel like between the Chaos Guardian and the Spirit one, I feel like the Chaos one was a little bit easier. So how's about we, we kind of ramp up the difficulty here? Oh, what in the world? Jeez. How about we go with like a, a slightly easier version of the tier four boss with the uh, the Chaos Guardian and then we move on over to the slightly harder one, or maybe even the straight up harder one. <laughs> Let's get another one of these bad boys going, and get him up to full health. He's up to 63 million health, or she actually, and of course 100,000% heck in melee damage, which is absolutely nonsense. Oh, I thought I cleaned out this guy's inventory. Ah, <sighs> oh, whatever. I cleaned out my inventory, which is all that really matters. Uh, I did hear something funny in just a second ago. What was that? Oh, there, oh, it's just regular old makeup with the kids, I think, hold on. Yep, there you go, killed the Megabith- or Gigantabithicus. Or, yeah, Megabithicus, that's what it's called, Gigantabithicus minions I just killed right there. <laughs> anyway, let's go over here, summon in the, uh, the Chaos Guardian, and let's see how we do against it. Has like, what, four-something billion health, I think? Here we go. It's supposed to have like, four billion health. Sometimes they have three, though, sometimes we're like, oh, four and a half billion right there, golly. Whoops, that's the wrong button. Here we go, here we go. Hit him with the Spirit Bomb attack. Is that going to get him? Yeah, beat him back here. Oh, I don't think any of that actually hit him right there. Come on, down here. Oh, there you go. A bunch of 1.8 millions right there. Nice. A bunch of 180. Oh, whoa! A bunch of 189,000 right there. If we can get a direct hit on him with the heckin' spirit bomb, that'd be crazy. Hold on. Oh, that meant. Oh, this, it is a little bit delayed. It is a little bit delayed. Oh, there we go. Look at all those spirit bomb hits right there. Holy heck. Go back into here. There we go. If we can get him. Oh, man. I missed his uh, magma puke attack right there, which is good. Hold on. Let's let, let's let him follow me. Already did 200 million egg and damage, and then we turn around, then we spirit bomb into his heckin' face. There we go. It, oh, it just exploded into him. Oh, wait, no. Oh, there we go. Oh, a bunch of hits right there. Oh, my gosh, my game is lagging out. Man. We're, we're, we're still doing pretty well in health, though. Just looking at the top left, or top right. Well, top left for you guys. I'm editing that part in. But yeah, he, he, he took another 100 million damage right there, which is crazy good. Yep, another sp- Oh, jeez. Oh, the game was going to heckin' crash right there because it couldn't handle the heckin' spirit bomb madness. Look at that! Look at all those millions of damage. I need I need to lure him over here and actually stay. Yeah, see, look at that. He keeps taking about 2 million damage every time. You know what? If I do a spirit bomb, I need to I need to stand still and we could probably soak up a little bit of damage as well. Here we go, here we go. Here we go. Whoop. I landed on the ground. Is he going to come over here? Oh, there he is. Oh, oh, jeez. I'm taking some damage from that flame breath. Hold on. Speaking of such, let's get some lightning breath on you. 189,000 every time he touches that lightning breath. Nah, I can't keep up with him that well. At least with the lightning breath. Uh, we keep spinning in circles and stuff. There we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. We're taking some hardcore damage. What in the world? Where did this thing spawn in? Alpha Mega, I think it's right there. Sheesh. All right, well, let's heal up. Or, oh man, we're slowed down right now. I think it's because of the, uh, the magma puke or whatever he did right there, huh? Well, speaking of such, holy, I just went directly into that. That was bad. Let's lure him directly into our spirit bomb area here. Oh my gosh. Bunch of flames there. I'm slowed down out the bottle. Man. Here you go. Here you go. Another spirit bomb right there. How do you like that, huh? 
There you go, explode him! Ah, oh, I think we missed every one of those missed. I can't see how much damage we're doing in the rearview mirror like that, though. That's kind of weird. But how much health does he have? He's down to four billion. We've done a half billion damage to him already, which is good. I, I, I don't know. Have we done that faster than the, uh... Oh, oh, oh. I don't know if we've done that any faster than the, uh, the, 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 what do you call it? The Chaos Wyvern that we had beforehand. How did none of those hit? At least we're killing his minions right there, which is good. Oh, there you go, there you go. Now we're doing a bunch of damage to him. I think we're doing the 189 millions. Where'd he go? There he is, there he is. Do a bunch of 189,000s. Did I say 189 million? I heckin' wish. <laughs> oh, it's probably how much we did in the combined- Oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa! It's probably how much we did in the combined amount of damage. Here you go, lure him into all that. That nonsense. There he is right there. Yeah, take it all down. Ah! Well, we're doing really well on health. We keep on taking our amazing new healing potions, dino healing potions, which honestly don't feel that OP. I know I got some comments of you guys saying, yeah, you should install a... Uh, oh, gosh. Pugnacia back in again, just so I can get the instant heal thing again. I don't know if that actually would work. Uh, well, I guess it would because it's just that we won't have a bunch of... Uh, like, Primal Fear thing spawning in again, because, like, kind of overlap with all the critters, I think, right? So, that's going to be one problem with that, but... I feel like this is just going to be, like, one long battle again. You guys remember last time when we took on the Spirit Guardian? That was an hour-long battle off-camera. Jeez, that was a direct hit on all of his minions right there. I don't know, this this definitely feels like it's going to be one of those, uh, long hanging battles here. Like, it's not going to be like the Thorny Dragon where we could just... Like, like, stack up a bunch of heckin' hits on him and do and so oh! Well, how do we not get killed there? I don't know, but holy heck, we, we took a significant amount of damage there. We need to watch out! Man! Look at all these minions! What could, Oh yeah, I looked into trying to rebind that right-click to zoom in thing. It, I guess I can't rebind it, which sucks. Hold on, hold on. Here we go, here we go. Here we go, spirit bomb right to his face! No! Get over here! Over here! There you go, walk into that, fly into it. Oh, nice, he just flew right into it. That's good, but... Unfortunately, he's not taking constant damage from it. Here we go. Fly back into here. There we go. A bunch of 1.8 millions. And a bunch of 189 thousands. Nice. Yep. How much does he have? Three point. Well, we've done about a billion damage. We've done almost a billion. That, that That's good. We we're surviving quite, quite well. And of course, this, this should be should be the easier variant. The chaos compared to the, the spirit variant, right? I don't know. Maybe the spirit's going to be a little bit easier because we, uh, we're, we're a spirit ourselves. I don't know. Maybe we're immune to the spirit bomb attack. It feels like I could spirit bomb, which is, by the way, I'm completely making that up. Although it is a very fitting name. Oh my gosh, look at all that damage. Nice, nice. Bunch of 189,000 on it. But it does feel like my spirit bomb has a, has a slower, or I guess a faster cooldown? I don't know how you describe it. But we're able to do the spirit bomb special attack a lot more frequently than we were able to do the uh, the magma puke attack, if you guys remember, from the Chaos Wyvern. It feels that way. And it is, is a lot more powerful, a lot more, uh, I don't know how you describe it. Like, 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 look at the way it spreads out there like a fan, but this one spreads out like a heckin', like a ball. And it has, like, a, a lingering effect where he walks into it and then he takes some damage. We've done over a billion damage to him so far, so you know what? I'd hate to do it. Oh, jeez. I can't even see him right now. I'd hate to do it, but I, I think I'm going to have to skip, like, the majority of the second battle, so it's not an hour. It's, it's probably not going to be an hour long. It's probably going to be, like, 20 minutes, to be quite honest, because it's only been, like... I'd say like seven, eight minutes so far. So yeah, maybe like 20 more minutes or something like that. But uh, still, I, I don't want to have a whole episode doing this. I definitely want to take on the spirit one. See how much harder, or maybe even... Oh, whoa! Whoa! I don't want to... Hopefully that doesn't happen too many times off camera. I end up dying. I'm like, hey, you guys remember how I was continuing to take on that guy off camera? Well, no, I'm heckin' dead. So guess we got to start over from square heckin' one with no uh, spirit wyvern, you guys. Because he heckin' died during the battle. Whoops. Yeah, let, let, let me continue doing this, and hopefully I don't actually die during the battle. We've got the healing, so you know, it's a pretty good uh, insurance policy, I guess you could say. So, as long as we, we actually heal up, I don't know why he's not healing right now. Oh, yeah, that's probably because of the automatic healing, right? I have to manually do it. Yeah, there you go. Hopefully that actually gets us going. But either way, yeah. Let me continue doing the, the rest of the... How much? Oh, man, we did another billion right there. Whoa, I must have got, like, a really good hit on him or something crazy. Holy heck. Let me do the other, uh, eh, about two billion more damage. I'll see you guys here in a bit once he has, like, half a billion health or something. I don't know. Something like that. Oh, man, I think I could... Can I stack Spirit Bomb attack? I'm doing it right now. He's stuck or something. Whoa. Whoa, he was taking a lot of damage, I, I think. You guys, I might not even need to pause. He was at 2.5... 2.5... 2. 
Oh my god, well, we're almost dead. We need to go, we need to go, 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 go. There you go, you're healing, you're healing. That's good, that's good, but we're almost, like, dead. Holy heck, look at our health. Cool down right now, though. We're under 10 million. 10, oh, yeah, 10 million. He's flying behind us, though. I don't think he heals. So, I, I, oh, man. Well, then we're also pretty low on stamina, too. That's that's not good. Yep. There's a spirit bomb on that hater. Oh, avoid all that. Nice. Get over here. Let all those land on you. And do some hardcore lingering damage. That'd be great. There we go. There we go. Nice. Nice. Okay, he just took another, uh, he automatically just healed right there. That's great. That's great stuff. I need to keep luring him over here. I don't know if I need to pause. Oh, man, it just, just ran out right there. He's at 1. So, whoa! He's at 1.6 billion. And we're still doing pretty well in health ourselves. Two seconds. I don't know if he's going to automatically drink that or what. Oh, he's distracted by something. There you go. Boom. Oh, the 20 second cooldown. Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. Get him with the spear. Ah! I got hit millions of damage right there. I just took millions of damage. That is bad news, bears. I don't know how much he's actually taking right now, though. He needs to fly back. No, he flew over. He flew over the lingering. Man. Ah. Okay, I'm going to spear bomb right there. Boom. Hopefully he walks into that. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. No, he flew it. He flew past it. Ah, I thought it'd be a lot easier than this, but the spear bomb effect or uh, whatever you'd want to call it. Takes a while to kind of land and all that. What is he doing? Oh, he's distracted by something else again. Man. See, I'm trying to kill him. I'm trying to lure him into my spirit bomb lingering, but it's just not working. Oh, there you go. There you go. Ah, oh, see, he takes a little bit of damage and then he just flies like right past it. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. Nice. Let's do another one right here. Boom. Boom. Really good direct. Oh, no, no. Yeah. It actually exploded a little bit too late. Man. Now, if I could heck and stack these up. Yeah, see, look at that. Another 400 million uh, health down right there. Nice. Just keep stacking up these heckin' spirit bombs, you guys. Like, look, look at how frequently I'm able to heck and use them. It's crazy. Oh, whoa. Avoid his heckin' special attack right there. Nice. He's almost at a billion. He's almost at a billion right now. I am pretty low on stamina, so I, I don't know. Ah, should I take a stamina break? What do I want to do? I don't know. I kind of want to go over here. We're somewhat safe, like let the terrain kind of get in his way like that. Yes, perfect. Look at that. That is amazing. He's basically true. Oh man, my stamina went up like instantly right there. You guys see that? That was crazy. There's a spirit bomb on him. I can, oh, 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 here we go. Here we go. Fly this away. No, he went around. What? Man. Thought we had a really good plan there. Here we go. Here we go. Spirit bomb right in his second face. Oh, <laughs> whoa. That was a really, really good hit. Fly back into it. Fly back into it. Boom. Nice. Do another one right here. He's kind of stuck. He's, 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 he's cocooned, I think. Oh, 100 million, 100 million, 180 million. You guys, look at how low he is. Can I just do the, I might just do the rest on uh these zippity zaps right there. Yeah, look at that, 176 million right there, nice. What do you have, whenever uh, the Spirit Guardian, whenever we, we killed him? I think he had 100 million, yeah. Somewhere around 100 million, and then I came back, and then we killed him with the, uh, the flame breath attack on our Chaos Wyvern. Man, I just need to avoid those, avoid those things, though. There you go, a bunch of 189,000. Amazing. Definitely want to get a few more of those comboed in. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Nice hit there, nice. Whoa. Of course, killing all their Dark Griffin minions there as well. Bunch of 189,000. I don't know. I kind of want to do another Spirit Bomb. Like, at least just one. There you go. How do you like that, Hata? There you go, all over him. Nice. Get over here. Get over here. Trick him into flying into this heckin spirit bomb trap. There you go, bunch of- oh, 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 Yes. Lingering damage. Yeah, see, look at that. That did like 50 million right there. Come on, fly back into it. Is he going to- Oh, yep, he's taking more. He's taking more damage. Perfect. Oh! Ah, well, we're still doing all right on health. I can tell for- Are we almost- Yeah, I think we are almost full health. Nice. Can't really tell for sure because my recording- like overlay or whatever is on the top right, so I can't always see my health. <laughs> there we go, a bunch of, you know what, let's take him down to 100 million health-ish, and then we'll do another spirit bomb, boom, 103 million, let's do another hit here. Bunch of 100, oh my gosh, nice, 99 millions there, let's do another spirit bomb there, boom. And let's load him up with a bunch of these, ah, taking some fire damage. Fly into that, eight elite his health draining on the bottom left. 24, 20 million, oh man, he barely survived that. Ah, man! We just did like 7 million! Nice! Maybe two more pass-throughs and we're good. Or flybys, whatever you want to call these. Here we go, here we go, here we go! Bunch of- Whoa! Oh, no, no, no. I think we're doing 300-something thousands to his uh, minions. There we go! There we go! Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. 
I think that's the Tambo version right there. Is that the Tambo version? Uh oh, I hit spacebar, so I'm landing. Yep, that's the Tambo version back there. Now, is that a high level one? Remember the, uh. It is, it is, 952. I kind of want to tame it. I honestly do. Hold on, little. Oh, is he. Oh, he's dagger on me, man. Because remember, the ones that we tamed were like, what, level 860 something? So this was like 100, actually, it's like 90 levels, uh, yeah, about 90 levels above the, uh... Oh, what in the, what in the, what, he died! What?! No! His, wait, what happened there?! Uh-oh. Hold on. <laughs> we gotta, I can load up this save, you guys. Hopefully this, hopefully this doesn't save right here, jeez. Hold on. How did he die right there? Really? Was this health draining or something? Like, obviously he's dead, but... Ah... Uh... I guess his health was draining or something during that. Man, I did not expect this thing to heck and die during that. We must have had some sort of damage over time. But he had a lot of, he had basically full health at the end there, didn't he? I don't know, I need to look at that footage. I need to figure out what happened. My health must have been draining super duper fast at the very end there, you guys. That is crazy. Hold on, let me, let me load up that save I just made a copy of like a minute ago. See if that is, like, before this guy died or, or what, I don't know. I guess we'll have to find out, but, uh, oh god, I'm about to die now, too. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, let, let me actually review that footage as well, because I'm curious what heck can happen to this guy right here. Sheesh. So I'll see you guys here in just a sec. All right, guys, back. Just got done watching the footage. And, yeah, he had, like, three effects on him, like, a purple one and, a, a, like, a broken bones, like, bleeding effect. And then, of course, the, uh, the, the, like, inflamed one, the one that we currently have right there on the top right, and he's, he's heading like straight towards me, by the way, so this is, this is pretty bad. <laughs> uh, we're doing okay on health right now, it's just a, oh, oh, whoa, 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 oh, I was landing right there, ooh, that's bad. See, we have the same effect going on right now, this is, oh man, three seconds, come on, come on. Look at how fast my health was draining right there. Hold on, there you go, heal, 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 heal. I need to just, just straight up fly away while, oh, there he is right there. While we have this effect going on, because I cannot survive. Ah, oh, man, is that healing me up as fast as I'm losing health? Mmm, kinda, it seems like it, uh oh, go, what are you doing, there you go, jeez, he's right behind me, almost got hit by that again, okay, now the effect has worn off, that's good, he's still flying around, still chasing me, which is, which kinda sucks, I want him to get aggroed on something else, and we could potentially come back with a, uh, a spear, or a chaos orb and tame him, and whatever, oh, there we go, light griffin right there, if we can get aggro on light griffin or something else, that would be good, cause I, I'm like, Man, I don't know. At least we're healing up right now, which is good. I just heard a uh, sip right there. So we should be taking another spirit thing, or uh, another 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 healing. 20% over 20, 30, 30 seconds, I think. I think the cooldown is 20 seconds. Why is this, he's still aggro on me from all the way back there, how? I'm so far away from there. I'm literally outside of render range right now. <laughs> okay, I had to outrun him there. What was he? Okay, I was supposed to heck and say, how's he still aggro on me when I'm outside of render range? <laughs> Okay, let's go back, let's go home. I don't know if we have the right materials to potentially knock out and tame him. And, uh, oh, I don't know why I said that. I, I meant to get a heckin' Chaos Orb or whatever. He is kind of like outside of that. I'm like, I guess if we spawn in the spirit version of him, we could just kind of avoid that area over there. But I, I kind of want to just tame him, we just kind of get that out of the way, you know? But yeah, speaking of, uh, I was thinking of like crop pods and stuff like that. And of course the, uh, the spirit, the, or the soul traps. What, what are those? What are those called again down there? Yeah, sword trap. You guys are saying those things have some pretty good range, especially if I use the uh, the gun over here. So yeah, definitely want to test those things out uh, here in the future. But I do want to see if we can make a chaos orb. Let's see, chaos. Man, I cannot. There you go, chaos orb. Can I make one of those? Ooh. Oh wait. Oh wait. Oh yeah, I need a origin blood though. Elemental kibble. We could do that. Celestial. Okay, let's do kibble. We could do celestial kibble. We could do uh, demonic kibble. I'm sure. Boom. Celestial kibble. Demonic kibble. Oh, I need fa oh, we can we can go get those. I'm sure. Uh, what else was I missing? Elemental cable. Okay, I need I need like four fabled eggs apparently, or however many. Uh, so let's go over here. We have plenty of fabled creatures, just constantly I can lay in eggs and all that kind of stuff. Let's go see how they're doing over here. There you go. See how we're doing. How many fabled? Uh, we have three, which is good because we need that for either a demonic or the elemental. Let's just say we kind of need more if we want to get both, right? So oh, what was there? Celestial egg, I think, just got dropped right there. Nice. See, any fabled over here? Oh, yeah, we got a couple more. Okay. So hopefully this isn't enough. I guess we can check here in just a bit. Thankfully, the, uh, yeah, the wyvern's not chasing us right now, which is good. And I guess we can see what the baseline of our uh, original one. Oh, yeah, I guess we can't. 
I guess unless we do a little bit of math to figure out what its level was before the Tainan bonus. What are we missing? Demonic Kibble, I believe? Let's get that. Wait, there you go. Jeez, it took a while to spawn in right there. Elemental Kibble, what are we- Oh, we can get that one too. Perfect! Alright, well, we should be able to- If we kill one Origin thing, which is easy peasy, no problemo, because remember- Oh yeah, uh, one more thing I want you guys- uh, I want to test out because you guys commented a few times last episode. Uh, remember last episode, we we're actually upgrading these scanner doohickey things over here so we can get the transmitter power up to 20 so we could get, get remote stats and all this stuff so if we want to find out like mail and baseline stuff like that we could actually see it on the bottom right there from our portable scanning thing uh right here because last episode we upgraded it to where we could actually uh see the map and i believe was there one was there another thing what uh yeah we already had a remote i guess it was just the map yeah I have 15 right here, so I guess we're working towards the remote stats. I guess some comments would be guys actually saying if I get a second one of these tech generators, like I guess that would double the transmitter power, which I guess kind of makes sense because you have two generators. Ooh. But at the same time, couldn't you get... I don't know, how expensive are these things? I was about to say, like, couldn't you just cheese it by just getting like a ton of these things or something like that? But it's probably decently expensive. Let me see. Tech generator, how expensive are they? Uh, 2400 metal ingots, but a transmitter. 2400, uh, 2500 right there. So, to get something that basically doubles how many transmitters you have for basically the same price as one more transmitter, that's that sounds a little bit imbalanced, but I guess we could check it out. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, what was it called again? Tech generator, I think, right? Yeah, there you go. I, I don't know if it works with the S Plus version of it. Oh, we're missing a little. Oh, wait, yeah, we have crystals uh, we can get down here, right? Yeah, we were missing some crystals to make actual. Uh, yep, we have plenty there. Perfect. What in the world? There we go. I don't know why I didn't pull my inventory right there. It's kind of went crazy. Oh, we got some apprentice uh, crystals up here. I forgot that you can have, like, different level, like, uh, crystals there, which is crazy cool. Either way, let me empty out some stuff here. Just kind of get some trash out of my inventory temporarily. Boom, there you go. There's a random megabithic thing right there. So, we do get crystals from these gotcha crystals. We just need, like, what, 100, something like that right there? Uh, we have 189. That should be good. That should be enough. Sand and salt and crystals and uh, silica pearls and whatever else there. Uh, whatever that was right there, obsidian. Let's put up the other stuff over here. I don't even know. I, I might just grind that stuff up. I'm not going to use it. <laughs> Alright. Might as well. Dinosaur gate. I think we'll put that up over here in the structures. Which I pretty much never use. Because I'm like, if I'm making a structure, I'm going to heck and use it. I'm just going to make it and then put it up or anything like that, right? Oh yeah, speaking of such, there's a structure right there. I guess I'm, t I'm like, you can't, you can't salvage it from this thing. So that kind of sucks. But whatever. There you go. The Dodicarus from Pugnacia, you were able to put structures in his inventory. That guy, of course, breaks down things. Uh, but of course, we don't have Pugnacia installed anymore, so we can't use that, of course. Of course, of course. I forgot to put the arrows up right there, but whatever. Let's drop, uh... Oh yeah, if I drop those off, I'm just gonna pick it back up from the gacha collector thing, right? Whatever. There you go. What was I doing just a second ago? I was like, oh yeah, let's go upstairs. <laughs> uh, we still have this thing going up there. Probably gonna make it super duper bright once it turns to nighttime. We'll see if we can make another uh, tech generator, and those things are... Whoops! Oh man, I was just about to say they're powered by heck an element. Turn this thing on, turn it back on, and just ate another element right there, I'm sure. Let's see, uh, generator. I, I really don't know why the game lags whenever I do that stuff. It's crazy. Let's see, boom. Yep, there you go. We can, we can do it. Boom. Noise. So if we get another one of these, and like I said, I don't know if it's going to work with the S Plus version of it. How many element do I have in there? Hold on. I literally have zero element in there. I need to load that up more, I guess. Uh, but this thing has like three, I think, so we can just steal one from over here, I believe, right? So, uh, let's see. Well, I, I think I have it looking like this. There you go, sure. We got two of those, so we can get another one of these. Boom, boom. Actually, you know what? Let, let's put an element there and pull an element. Godly, we have a lot. Uh, upgrade station. Why is that even over here in the first place? Let's grab it all. Boom. 106, 54. Hold on. 107. Okay, perfect. We have exactly 54 in each one now. Noise. So if I activate power here, is this going to double like you guys said? Yeah, it did. Wait, what? Wait, hold on. Why does that work? I, I, I don't know, but I'm not complaining because the transmitter power is 30 now. So you guys were right. I guess if we wanted to get the uh, the 20 for remote stats and remote map, all we needed was four more last episode. Because I think we had before last episode when I made more, I think we had six. So I guess we only need four more. I made nine more. So pfft. I guess we just threw away a bunch of agony resources, right? That kind of sucks, but hey, thank you very much for the suggestions, you guys. <laughs> so, if I go over here to Dino Scan, this should basically be the same thing. Every, like, if I wanted to find an Alpha Dinonicus, boom, there it is on the map, and boom, there are all of its baselines. It's gender, male. Can't find it. There you go, there's a female. So, if I wanted to find an origin, 
Uh, is there one like relatively nearby base? Uh, I might be able to find that one. I failed. I, I killed a few uh, Origin Spinos off camera, by the way. They're like by that peninsula. It was really easy to find them. But now they're not respawn. Oh, wait. Hold on. There's a Kairuku up there. And over there. And like, oh, there's two of them like right up in that general area near 11 and like 50 ish. Hold on. Let me. I guess we'll fly over there at 11 and 50 at the tech and top of the map. See if we can kill a couple of Origins. Because, of course, if we want to do. Uh, like, what was it called? Chaos Orbs? We need to make. Uh, we need to kill a heckin'. I think just one origin thing. I think we're missing just one origin blood, so hold on. Let me go up to like, what, 11 and 50? Yeah, that's like right around here. Oh, wait, hold on. That's, we're going to get in range of the other guy, though. Ooh, we don't want that. We don't want the heck and wyvern to get in range of us, though. Hopefully, we're not going to get in range of him, but we're at 11. I think it was like just at 50 ish. So, the easiest way to see the heck and origin thing, you'll see like a big yellow sphere. Oh, wait. What's that sound? Is he? Oh, wait, no. There he is right there. Boom. Let's kill him. We got a spirit bomb right there. Boom. Taking constant damage. We're going to kill him. I need to be near him so I can actually get the blood as a victory sort of thing. Look at all the four points. Boom. There you go. Origin sold. Did I get the origin blood though? I did. Awesome. Perfect. Okay. Well, I guess we're good to go here, huh? <laughs> I can kill that Kairu right there. Origin Kairu. See, look at, look, at, look at this. This is absolutely insane. I think I got a comment from someone last episode saying, hey, why, why don't you kill an origin thing? Uh, last episode when we're going on the... Oh, there's another one like right here. When we're going on the rampage. Pfft. Like, look at this. It's basically nothing. There's another one around here somewhere. I thought I just saw it a second ago. I saw, like, a yellow... You guys saw the yellow orb, too, right? Did it just glitch into the ground or something? I'm like, that's happened before. I would not be surprised if it happened to this guy. I'm like, oh, jeez. Oh, my God. <laughs> look at that. Huge damage everywhere. But uh, I, I, I don't think... I think the Kairuka, like, despawned or fell through the map or something here. Origin... Yeah, see, there's only one on the map, and it's on the top right corner now, so that guy sucks. Well, I don't know. Oh, whoops. Well, I don't know where the, uh, the, the uh, Chaos Wyvern is right now, which kind of sucks, because we want to come back over here anyways to potentially tame him once we actually have the Chaos Orb. Uh, so I kind of want to know where he is, but at the same time, I guess... Oh, wait, no, the, the, there he is right there. There he is. Hold on. Yep, he was, like, right there. I just saw him a second ago. Okay, you know what? Let's go home, make the Chaos Orb. And I guess we could tame them, and then hopefully by the end of the episode, we have enough time. Hold on, I, there's so many things grouped together right here, I kind of have to spear orb. I kind of have to, like, look at all that stuff that's just in that general area. Oh, after all that, I killed literally nothing but a snow elf. <laughs> oh, wait, we killed a fable to mammoth as well, okay. Eh, I guess it's not that big of an area of effect as I thought it was, jeez. But, let's go back here and inspect the castle orb, see if we can knock that guy out, tame him, and of course take him out of the heckin' picture. Uh, get him on our side, and of course we'll have to worry about him during the Spirit Guardian boss battle here in a sec, right? So, let's see. I think I have it in my... Yep, there it is right there. So, uh, let's make the orb. Not org. Orb. There you go. Wait, now I'm missing the Fabled Egg? Okay. Pfft. Hopefully this stuff over here laid more Fabled Eggs. We've got a few Fabled things, because, you know, I, I need heckin' Fabled Eggs. A lot of them do, so. Hopefully it laid at least two Fabled Eggs throughout the time that we've been just memeing around the past, like, ten minutes or whatever. Yep. Let's see. Fall down! There you go. Over here. None! What? Okay. I guess I'll have to buzz the recording and wait for two more Fabled Eggs and... I don't know, I guess I, if anything, I could lure him just further away from... Or just spawn in the second boss in some other area, right? Like, what's stopping me from there? I just like that area because it's nice, open, no trees, no mountains. Well, there's some cliffs and stuff like that, but nothing too crazy. It's a relatively flat, open area. That's, that's my heckin' boss battle arena. So I kind of want to move him away from that area. I don't want to have to take on another area or like go to... Oh yeah, those are origin things. Those are all completely outdated now. You know, I, I kind of like that area over there. I don't want to move out of there. But uh, yeah, I guess I'll have to wait here for some heckin' eggs to spawn in. So let me just pause the recording, wait for eggs, and I'll see you guys here in a bit once we get, get the Chaos Orb and potentially knock out and tame this Chaos Guardian. Get hit, or Chaos uh, Wyvern, regular one. Level 900 something though, but still. Pretty good, and then we can take on the Spirit Guardian with our Spirit Wyvern over here. And hopefully he's going to fare a little bit better against the Spirit Guardian compared to the uh, Chaos Guardian. Because that thing was unexpectedly pretty heckin' powerful, especially there at the very end. I don't even know if that was the Guardian that did that, like, main damage over time effect, or if that was the, uh, the Tamble version. That might have been the Tamble version that did the, uh, the, like, broken bone, like, uh, damage over time that, like, basically killed us there. I would not be surprised, but either way, let me pause the recording. And I'll see you guys here in just a bit. Alright, guys, I'm back. I'm, I've got two more eggs. 
which is good because we need that for the orb. There you go, Chaos Orb. Boom! Okay, so we get the Chaos Orb. Now we can tame the uh, the Chaos Wyvern here in just a bit. If we can knock it out, we do have four arrows. One already loaded inside of our uh, bow here, and of course, uh, three of them inside, I guess, a quiver or some weird meme. Let's turn this thing off because it's been on all night and it's been bright and loud as heck, though. But uh, let's go over here to grab the orb. And I guess we'll go back over there and see if we can actually knock out and tame that thing. Uh, so, oh, we need to be pretty careful, though, because, of course, that thing does a lot of damage and especially damage over time. So, we just want to get it on our, on our tail, let it chase after us. And then, of course, do what we did last episode. Remember, oh, there it is right there. Perfect. Let it, let it chase after us and then just turn around instantly and then, oh, man. And then, and then shoot at it and then boom, we're good. Oh, it's going? It, oh, it's flying away though. Oh, it's almost. Oh wait, no, it's a chaos. Wait, it's a chaos guardian. Wait, what? I guess I lowered in the save a little. The save happened a little bit before I killed the chaos guardian. Ooh, so we still need to kill it. And of course, if I kill it, it's going. It's going to have the tameable version of it. And then we can tame it, right? Okay, okay, I understand now. Oh, there you can do a little bit of damage right there. Make sure it won't take too much damage for him though. Let's get a. Uh, you know. Where is he? Where is he? Spirit bomb time. Hey, uh, fly into that. Come back this way. Land right into the spirit bombs. Hey, uh, here you go. Here you go. Here you go. Oh, he's stuck on some. Oh, man, he landed in some terrain. Oh, wait, no, he's taking some damage. There you go. Bunch of 1.8 million. Whoa, a bunch of hits, right? Stop landing. Stop it, man. It takes like a whole second for me to land and then pick back up. And now we're all slowed and now we're taking damage over time. Oh, he's down to 45 million, though, so we're doing some great damage there. Are we doing... Uh, okay, I thought we were on cooldown for that, but I guess not. He's, like, right behind us. Man, I was confused whenever we saw him. It, was, it said Chaos Guardian. I was about to say, like, what? Actually, I think I did say that. <laughs> but I was very confused for that split second or whatever. Ah, oh, he's still, like, right there, though. Hold on. Spirit spirit bomb right there. Hopefully it lands on him or near him or something. Here you go, here you go, here you go. Oh, come back in this way. Nice! A lot of damage there. Man, he's down to 28 million health, but man, we're, we're draining as well. We need to watch the heck out there. Oh, I think he's taking a lot of damage right there. Oh, I, oh, 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 his projectiles. He's down to 14 million. I really need to watch out. Here you go, here you go. Oh, nice. Automatically drank that right there. That was not me. Here you go, here you go. He oh, no, he's got more pro Oh, man, I was about to say, there's projectiles in the background, so he doesn't have any projectiles ready, but no. He did have some ready. Ah, man, I'm getting it. getting no hits there. Here you go, spirit bomb time. Hey, do. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Land in it. R run right into it. Hate a nice! Chest Guardian down, but is it killing the table version? I hope not. I hope not. Oh, did it? Is that the table version? Oh, please do not tell me that's the heckin' table version, right? It was caught in the spirit bomb and ever. It was. It. Oh, jeez. I thought the game was going to crash right there. Oh, that's terrible. Come on. Man, I had the Chaos Orb and everything there. So now, do I really have a Chaos Orb for no reason right now? Ah, oh, that's such a... Oh man, there's a heckin' loot. Ah, something down. I need to kill it. It's gonna cause havoc there. Uh, Buffoon gigant over these. Man, I can see there are two dead bodies. There's one right there and a smaller one down there. That's gotta be the table. What? What is happening? No, stop. Man, I think he wants to loot the dead body. There we go. Is he set to, uh... What is he set to? Attacking target. Okay, go to passive, at least for right now. I don't want to move it anywhere, but... See, that's kind of why I was like, I don't want to use the, the, the spirit bomb for the killing blow. Yeah, see, here's the Chaos Guardian. And then back here is going to be the tameable version of it. The smaller one. Back here. Let's see. It's going to be Chaos Wyvern, like level 900 something. Not like that, right? I think it is. No, wait, no, is this the same one? It's just that his body's like weirdly stretched or what? What is this? What is this? Yeah, Chaos Guardian. Hold on, let me chainsaw him. There you go. Oh wait, no, that was the whole- wait, did one not spun in? Uh, it looked like two separate bodies there. Uh, is it still around here somewhere, maybe? I don't know. I feel like I would have seen it by now if it is still floating around, but... Yeah, I don't know. Did one not spun- hold on, I need to re I need to look at the footage now. <laughs> I need to look at the footage that l I'm literally still recording right now. And see if it said, oh, killed... Uh, Chaos Wyvern level 900 something at the top of the- if that- if that's the case, and that sucks, we killed it there. Man. Made the Chaos Orb, all that kind of stuff, we're able to tame a higher level version of it and stuff, but... Ah, whatever. 
At least, at least we're able to kill the heckin' tier 4 boss using the tier 4 type creature like this thing. That's good. Kind of sucks that we waste, waste some materials there. Making the Chaos Orb and, of course, not having a, anything to spend it on. I, I guess if anything, we have a Chaos Orb. You guys have been saying, hey, what, what was, what was that one called? There was a Dota Wyvern, I think, a Chaos, there's like three or four, like, Chaos exclusive type. Yeah, Chaos Manticore is one of them. Dota Wyvern, Dragon, if we can get, oh, Broodmother, really? Like, I know, I'm not really crazy about the Broodmother back in the center. I remember having, like, Broodmothers, like, tamed and stuff. They're good at damage output and stuff like that, but honestly, like, once you get to a heckin' flyer like a dragon, they, they, they kind of outclass them, you know? So, don't really want to use a Broodmother. I'm like, yeah, Wyvern is what we have right now. We have Spino and Rex on the map right now. I don't want to tame them, especially because they're low levels, heck, and ground graders. But if we get a heckin' Dota Wyvern to spawn in the map, or a dragon, or a heckin' Manticore, I guess we could use the Chaos Orb on those things. Those would be crazy upgrades from what we have right now. And of course, would be, those would be Chaos, not Spirits, so. Wait, what, what happened to my crosshairs? Have my crosshairs always been that circle for this guy? I guess I never noticed. Hold on, we have some guys right here. Yep. Kill those Apex and Dominant. You guys remember, like, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, those are minions right there. What episode, what episode is this right now? Like, 50-something, 60-something? I don't know what episode this is. 70-something? I think it is. You guys remember, like, 30 episodes ago when we have Apex uh, in Dominus Rex, and I was, like, freaking out about how much heckin' damage it does? And we just one-shot it right there in just in passing, not even really paying much attention to it at all. It's just like, a uh, couple Apexes just spawned in right there, yeah. Oh, I guess we'll just zap him real quick with our zappy breath and boom, there you go. Defend our base. Oh, just real look at you split while yawning. Yeah. <laughs> but now they're absolutely nothing. Jeez. All right, well, I guess I'll end off the episode right here. We don't have enough time to do heckin' Spirit Guardian on top of this uh, Chaos Guardian and, you know, getting the Chaos Orb and all that kind of stuff that we did as well. So that kind of sucks, but whatever. I, I don't want to have like 10 trillion year long episodes, you guys. So, I guess we'll have to put up the, uh, or put off the Spirit Guardian one until next episode, and of course, I don't know, maybe next episode, uh, maybe I'll do Destroy All Wild Dinos a few times, and see if I can actually see a, uh, Chaos Dodo Wyvern, or a Manticore, or a Dragon spawning in, because I, I've done Destroy Wild Dinos, like, th three or four times ever since we started taming Chaos, or, you know, just looking for and taming Chaos and Spirit level, yeah, what, what are the Spirit things are actually in the map right now? I guess I can check check the mobile version of it now. I don't have to actually go over there because this is the same as going over there in the first place, which is great. Uh, spirit. Yeah, see, look at There's only like five things over here. Wyvern, we already have that. Rex, bleh. Griffin. Eh, I guess some comments are saying to get the Griffin because you could actually use like uh, the bow and stuff like that while uh, mounted on them. Spinal and Thylacolia. Eh, not crazy about it. I don't know why Chaos has like all these other things over here. It's kind of crazy. Uh, but yeah, the Manticore, Dota, Wyvern, Dragon. If I see any of the, those things spawn in with me doing Destroy All Wild Dinos, of course, definitely want to try and tame those next episode, but, you know, definitely next episode we're going to try and take on the Spirit Guardian using our Spirit Wyvern. See how, how that one's going to go. Is it going to be harder or is it going to be easier? I guess we'll have to wait and find out, but until then, thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below, and if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button, and of course, while you're down there, be sure to ring that bell so YouTube sends you a notification as soon as next episode comes out. Because it's going to be a crazy one just like this episode, so you guys don't want to miss that one. But until then, thank you guys all very much for watching, and I'll see you guys here next time with some more Ark Valgero. Oh, bye there. <laughs>